Hello, everybody. My name is Father Whammy, and I'm so glad that you could join us today for Children's Homily. It's so good seeing each and every one of you to be here with me today. Now, Father Charlie will be here in just a minute to do a children's homily, but he told me to go ahead and read a passage from the book of Romans. Does anybody out there know who wrote the book of Romans? I'll give you just a moment to think about it. Well, if you said the Apostle Paul, then you would be correct. Okay, I'm going to read a passage from the book of Romans. Let love be genuine. Hold fast to what is good. Love one another with mutual affection. Outdo one another in showing honor. Serve the Lord. Rejoice in hope and persevere in prayer. The word of the Lord. It was so good seeing each and every one of you today, and I hope you have a great rest of the day. Father Charlie will be with you in just a minute. Welcome to Children's Homily, and I'm so grateful to Father Whammy for doing the reading this morning. Father Whammy is uh, new, and you'll be seeing him over the course of the next year. Uh, he is really smart, and he's a lot of fun. So I look forward to everybody getting to know Father Whammy just a little bit better this year. Now, you may be wondering where I am at. Well, this is the chapel at Episcopal School of Nashville. In addition to being a priest at St. Bartholomew's, I'm also a chaplain at Episcopal School of Nashville. And I thought it'd be kind of cool to get to share this space with all of you kids at St. Bartholomew's. Now, <laughs> Father Whammy read us a passage from the book of Romans. And in the, from the passage of the book of Romans, he read, let love be genuine. And he said, love one another with mutual affection and outdo one another in showing honor. Now, let me ask you all a question. Do you like it when people say really nice things to you or do something really nice for you? How does it make you feel? Does it make you feel really good? Well, it makes me feel really good when people say really nice things to me. And so when the Apostle Paul was writing the book of Romans, he was telling us to let our love be genuine. Now, how can we let our love be genuine? Well, he gives us a hint. He tells us to outdo one another in showing honor. Now, what does honor mean? Honor means lifting up one another. When you come to church and we say our prayers, we are honoring God. We are lifting our voices up to God, and we are showing God love. We're showing God that we respect God, and that's very important to do. But God also wants us to honor and lift up one another. So how do we do that? Well, it can start from doing something simple. If you see your brother or sister in the morning, you can start by giving them a nice greeting. You can also be nice to your parents. Uh, if you are in school, you when you show up to school, you can give a compliment to somebody in your class. It might make their day a little bit better. Now, think about it for just a moment. When people show you kindness on your birthday, they are honoring you. They are lifting you up. Birthdays are very special to all of us. And on our birthday, it's really good to feel honored. We feel really, really good. What if we honored each other on a daily basis? What if this week you honored your parents, you lifted up your parents by cleaning up your bedroom without being asked? What if you offered to help with the dishes after dinner? 
I think that would put your parents in a really good mood and you would lift them up and you would show them love and your love would be genuine, just like the Apostle Paul said. So this week, as you go forward, I hope that you honor each other and show your brothers, your sisters, your parents, and everybody that you come into contact with, you show them honor. It will make the world a better place, and that will show us how your love can be more genuine. I'm going to close in prayer, and then I have a special guest that's going to make some a special announcement. So after the prayer, stick around for just a second for some important announcements. The Lord be with you. Let us pray. Most gracious God, we thank you for our church at St. Bartholomew's. We thank you for all of our friends. We thank you for all of our teachers. We pray this week that you will help us to let our love be genuine, that we can show honor to one another, and we can lift each other up through kindness and through love. We ask this through your Son, our Savior, Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Well, thank you so much for joining us. And here in just a second, I've got a very special guest who's going to make some special announcements. Hey, everybody. It's me, Sir Droopyhead. And I'm so glad that you all decided to join us this morning. We've got some really cool things happening at St. Bartholomew's that we wanted you to know about. Children's Formation will begin next Sunday, September the 13th, with Catechesis of the Good Shepherd Zoom for Levels 1 and 2. That will begin at 8.30. An Upper Elementary Zoom will begin at 8.55. There will be some more additional information on the e-news that will be sent out. And if you have any questions, you can contact Carla at St. Bartholomew's. I'm really looking forward to all this children's formation. It's some of my favorite things, and it's so much fun. So we look forward to seeing you on September the 13th. You all have a very good day.